Now, um, so why is O&M so important? It can mean the difference, really, between having a viable project or having a project that goes insolvent. It has a direct and very significant um, impact on, uh, on your revenue stream. And uh, OEMs are typically, as you know, offering a 97 or so percent availability guarantee on the equipment. And, uh, you know, that, that's fine. Uh, but you may want to consider something that's known as an energy yield guarantee. And I should probably explain that. The 97% availability guarantee on the equipment simply just means that the OEM um, uh, guarantees an uptime of 97%. And whether it's windy or not, it's what they're doing. Uh, an energy yield guarantee looks at the energy that flows through the project, uh, and it matches that up against the actual output. So you have a theoretical energy produced versus an actual energy produced. And you want to narrow that gap as much as possible. And the better the OEM provider, uh, oh, sorry, the OEM and provider, uh, provider performs, the better, you know, obviously the more revenue is produced, and some of that offside could be shared. Equally, if they fall below a guaranteed level, then there should be liquidated damages. It aligns uh, everyone uh, uh, across uh, the project, whether you're a project owner or operator, very nicely. We because we have seen in the past that 97% availability guarantees are, are great. Um, but towards the end of the year, when uh, uh, the provider, it's typically the OEM, uh, knows that they're no longer in jeopardy of running below 97%, there's a risk that they start throttling back and that they are not nearly as anxious to address issues. And what that does is simply leave uh, you as investors in these projects with a sub-optimized sub -optimized operation. 